Try reversing this file, can you? I forgot the password to this file. Please find it for me. All right, so let's grab this. So it's an executable. Probably not a good idea to run a random executable on my machine, but this is their web shell. I'm going to make it executable. Uh, whoops. Make it executable. We'll run the program. It's going to ask for a password. That's the wrong one. So if we do strings, we actually see here password correct. Please see the flag. So there is actually my flag. Uh, I've also got this over here in Ghidra where I can reverse engineer it back to C code. And we'll see that there's a string compare before that. And these bunch of bytes here correspond to the password it's looking for. Now, if it were a more complicated situation, I might want to use a dynamic strategy using a debugger. So I'll show you a little bit about what that looks like. We'll say GDB. We'll do a break in the string compare. Actually, we'll start the program first. Then we'll do a break in the string compare. Now, the string compare has two arguments that are being compared. And on a 64-bit machine, those are passed in RSI and RDDI. So RSI and RDI are going to be pointers to those strings. So there's the string that it wants. There's the string that I passed in. So if we copy this, you'll see that this is the password I was looking for, then it gives me this flag. Let me take that flag. and stick it over here, and there we go. 